Dr. Will here, live in the backyard, and I am with Jess. She was nervous to step up to me. I won't bite nervous hard. Nervous not the adjective I would use, but okay. Well, I'm here to help you because October 2nd, Bold and the Beautiful is going to air. I'm Tell us a little bit about your role. Um, I don't know how much I'm allowed to tell you guys, but I will tell you it's October 2nd. There's definitely some Big Brother, like, comical situations that go down, so you should definitely watch it. Um, I've filmed two episodes before, and... uh, Two episodes of Bold and Beautiful already? Two episodes so far, and they're having me come back, so it's been an incredible experience, and I really love the entire cast, and you guys should tune in. We will definitely tune in. Are you afraid of being typecast? No, I mean... As, like, a proctologist. Probably, yes. Absolutely. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's organic. There's Big Brother willing. hijinks. It makes sense. I can't believe you're willing to stand this close to me. You never know what I could I do. Know. I am worried. I am yeah. worried. I wore three pairs of underwear just in case. Let me find But, out. you know, the thing is, <laughs> I come from a long line of people who like butt poking, so I'm cool with it, you know? We get kinky Same. at the Kirby household. Same. Um, but on a very serious note, your man won America's favorite player tonight. Men. It was so satisfying. You know, I knew that if we didn't, we have the same kind of fan base and they're incredible human beings. And I asked them to unite the vote and get behind Cody. And even some people who didn't love Cody still were like, okay, if that's what you're asking for, they did it for us. We pulled out a win. Thank you so much. I'm ecstatic. They, they really did come through for you. Were you worried about splitting the vote? You thought you were going to get a lot of votes. He was going to get a lot of votes. Next thing you know, Kevin just wanders in and wins it. Kevin's an incredible human being. He's so polite. He's so nice. He's very likable. He's very funny. I knew that if we didn't unite the votes that we would lose to Kevin. And as much as I love Kevin, I do love Cody more. So I had to root for him. It's completely fair. Now, I am putting everyone on the spot tonight to discuss showmances. Okay. I know a lot about showmances, and we have three major showmances this season. We're asking everyone, which couple's going to stay together, which couple is going to have an immediate baby, and which couple's going to break up tonight? I think everyone probably answers the same thing. Well, um, people, you'd be surprised. America loves Raven and Matt's showmance. What show are you watching? <laughs> I, I mean, there's a, big, there's a big contingency that just is into that stuff. Agree to disagree. Um, I think that the second Matt gets a hold of his phone and sees Raven Exposed Party or her butt scab eating, he's going to break up with her. So that's probably immediate. <laughs> is this where I pull the plug or we just keep going? Is that okay? <laughs> Clearly, I don't know. I I mean, mean, like, they're not bringing me back anyway after my (laughs) interviews, so we can just keep going. Um, I can't comment on that, but, you know, things happen. Who hasn't, you know, eaten their own butts? (laughs) I'll poke a butt. I haven't. I have not. Out of it, I'm going to pass. I have definitely not done that. What? um, Okay, so where do we go from here, CBS Interactive? Am I fired? Like, I'm officially fired, right? Are supposed to keep this one PG? Was this PG? PG Oh. Who did you? So. Hi, CBS. Tonight with um, with Paul. Paul losing, or you should say Josh winning, were you pleased that Josh won, or were you secretly pleased that Paul lost? You know what? It was just good TV. I, it doesn't matter about who won and who lost. Uh, a lot of people did good things. You're lying. Me. You're lying. You no, loved that no, Paul lost. No, it was just good television, because if Paul had won, it would have been so predictable. So the fact that Josh won was just, it, it shocked everybody. I was absolutely floored. So it was good TV, and I love good TV. There's nothing wrong with good TV, which brings up my last question. You are an incredible competitor. You're obviously attractive. CBS clearly loves you. They're putting you on the bold and beautiful. Are we going to see you back next year? For Big Brother? For Big Brother. You know, if CBS calls and asks, we'll definitely talk about it. Fair. That sounds affirmative to me. It was a diplomatic response. Very nice to see you. I'm going to let you walk that way while I protect my butt cheeks this way. And um, and we're going to watch Bold and the Beautiful October 2nd. When's the next one air? We don't know yet. I can't remember the date. Okay. It's on my Twitter. On her Twitter. Go to her Twitter. What is your Twitter? The Jessica Graff. Not, not to be confused with the other ones. Yeah. The. The, uh, well, Jessica Graff is very upset that she keeps getting fans, like, DMing her and tweeting her. She's not happy. So, shout out to that girl. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure she's doing great. Maybe she wants to go on next year, you know, on Big yeah, Brother. I don't think so. No.